welcome back to the video. In today's video, I'm gonna be v Lime Shop for tonight. So, anyways, the Grizzabel skin is here, which is just a zombie version of Grizzab. I mean, Isabel. And it says voted most likely to crave rains or haunt the place forever. So, uh, it's kind of like a little twist to the Grizzabel skin. So, this is the default color. <clears throat> so, these are actually the jump scares that um are in the game now. So, sometimes random props just change into the skin like zombies and then like they jump scare you i swear and i've jumped like out of my bed once because it is i, I swear and when you don't expect it it is very it's like whoo but uh there's also a cotton candy style which is just a pink and blue style <coughs> Then we got the backbiter back bling. This is the default color. <clears throat> it's like a bow tie, but with teeth and, you know, just ugly. And then there's also the backbiter cotton candy style, which again is just pink and blue. Also, the eye color in the middle did change to blue, so. Size. And then we got the Ravina skin. This is the default style for uh, Ravina. <clears throat> so this will probably be in spooky offers tomorrow night. Also, we should be getting a new uh, a new uh, week well, in our last week, actually, of Fort Nightmares cards. And also, uh, I mean, we will be getting some short nightmares this week, too, if you don't know what it is. They didn't really announce that much information about it, but if you read the Fort Nightmares blog post, then you'll see what I mean. <clears throat> There's also a glow style for Ravina, but these are the glass wings back oh my god my ps4 sound like a jet engine right now do you guys hear that and then we got the glowing glass wing style and then we got the fright clubs pickaxe And then we got the siren skin. And didn't this skin release like a couple days ago? I swear, it feels like this released a couple days ago. I did not review this a long time ago. The thing is, skin like these, skins like these come out like <laughs> every month, like 29 to 32 days. But there's also a noir style for siren. And then we got the last kiss back bling. This is the default style. And then we got the noir style. Also, let me know if you if you think there is ways to shorten my item shop reviews, because I don't want people to, well, I don't want to make people uh, watch 10 minutes of a video, you know, to see the item shop and stuff. So I wanted also tips from you guys on how to make my item shop reviews shorter. There's also a noir style for the wolf skin too. <coughs> And then we got the pelt pack back bling. This is the default style for the pelt pack. And then there's also a noir style for the pelt pack. And then we got the exo axes pickaxes. So there is multiple versions and I don't mean like styles, but there is like uh, multiple pickaxes. So these are like just dual pickaxes and then there's also the reflex blades. I'm pretty sure the XL axes are for siren and then the reflex blades are for wolf. But uh, and now we're going to the second feature tab. So we have the human build skin. I'm gonna go into my locker to actually review the skin. Also, I'm not trying to flex anything in my locker, so. You can change the headpiece to just default, earphones gray, uh, baseball, or glasses. <clears throat> you could change the skin color to default green, gray, or pink. You could change the skin overlay to default farmer's tan tattoo crop circles or tattoo lines. You could change the tops to white, drift, llama, cuddle team, white tank, drift tank, llama tank, cuddle team tank, and then a suit. And then uh, the bottom, you could choose default, tropical, meow, stills, camo, jeans, ripped jeans, and also just suit. So, um, <clears throat> yeah, uh, and there's over 4,000 style combinations for human build. Also, it does come with uh, the weather balloon or a weather balloon back bling. 
No, it does not have any customable style, uh, customizable styles or anything like that. But you know, it's just a little back bling that'll probably fit for any style because he's still an alien for any style. But these are the Freezy Friends pickaxes. Honestly, I don't really know what it is because it's probably a popsicle, but there's like that yellow goo coming out of it, so I always think it's cheese, which is weird. Now we got the Bush Ranger skin. Oh my god. <laughs> This is too much, man. Actually, I think I'm just gonna, like, I think I'm just gonna review them quick. So this is a blooming bush ranger style. So they each have like a season. So this is for uh, spring. This is for autumn. This is the autumn bush ranger style. And then there's also a winter bush ranger, obviously for winter. And then we got the Dream Ranger style, which isn't for any season, like, uh, in real life. But, uh, it's supposed to be, um, for the actor of Captain Marvel's little club called Bush Babies. Honestly, I, I would <laughs> look it up if I were you, because I barely know what it is. But this is the Buzzy Bag Backling. This is the default style. There's also the Blooming Buzzy Bag style. The Autumn Buzzer style. So whenever a uh, skin or something has a ton of styles like this, I'm just gonna review it like this fast, cause I don't want to spend all my time this item shop review, just reviewing everything and taking <laughs> half the time just reviewing a skin and other cosmetics with like uh, a ton of other styles. So yeah, uh, and these are the Honey Hitters. There's also the Syrupy Slicer style, the Sticky Slicer style. The Maple Machette style. And then the Celestial Slicer style. And then we got the Bunny Wolf skin. So there is just a reactive or neon bunny style. So this is the reactive style. I will go over the reactivity in a second. So the reactivity, when you activate it, it does turn you into the neon wolf style. But you can do only the neon bunny or only the neon wolf without having to activate the reactivity in game to switch between the styles. So basically, uh, and you and you have to switch style. So and you can switch switch styles in in the middle of a game by uh, changing between your harvesting tool and weapon. <coughs> so this is uh the neon blue style for the heart red back bling. And then there's also a neon pink style. And then obviously the reactive style where it's reactive. Also all these skins and stuff are react the same way. Uh, he, well, and this is the neon llama style. And then, the, and then we got the neon line style and obviously there is just a reactive style if you want the reactivity. And then we got the diamond grid back bling. This is the neon purple style. And then there's also a neon orange style. And obviously I'm gonna see this again. Uh, there is obviously a reactive style where you can turn on the reactivity. And then we got the neon mole wrap. I, I, I don't know if it's reactive just like all the other cosmetics, but it is also animated. This is like that retro sunrise. You guys know what I mean. But uh, n now we're going to the daily help with the bracer skin. And then we got the dark heart skin with the heartless wings back bling. And we got the Pokey Emo, or Icon Zoom Emo. And we got the Juggling Emo. And 
then we got the behold emote. Behold the behold emote. That sounded so stupid. But um, anyways, that'll be it for today's video. The stars team slash Resident Evil stuff are still here. The Space Fair Ariana Grande and Rift Toy Ariana Grande are still here. The Dune skins, uh, including Chani and Paul Traders are still here. Uh, all of these spooky offer stuff are still here. And all these packs are still here also. And as you can notice, uh, the Cape Crusader slash Batman pack has been removed from the item shop also. So um, that'll be it for today's video. Have a great day or night. Thank you.